The Applicant Revisions Permit Application Status Welcome to the Eclipse Instructional Video Series. In this video, we're going to show you how to review and resubmit requested revisions of plans or documents submitted as part of your permit application. At this point in the process, your permit application has been submitted, accepted online by the department, being in review with city staff, and is now showing in your Eclipse account with an application status of Applicant Revisions. If your application status is Application Incomplete, this video may not apply to you because the city has not yet accepted your review. Documents requiring revision can be updated through your Eclipse account in four easy steps. Open, Review, Update, and Resubmit. Adobe Acrobat Reader is required to complete Step 2. Download it for free from the Adobe website. Let's start with Step 1. Open your permit. On your Eclipse homepage, scroll down and open your permit with the applicant revision status. Once on the permit page, click Additional Information Required at the top of the screen. Step 2. Review your required corrections. From this revisions required screen, you can see a preview of your required corrections. To view the full correction comments, download the document from the next section. The markup area of this section includes several symbols. The I symbol means something has been added to your document such as a stamp, but no actions are required. The orange triangle means this document has corrections that must be addressed. And the last symbol is used for downloading documents to view any added markups. Let's view our corrections. Click the download symbol then open the document with Adobe Acrobat Reader. In Adobe, view the full comments by selecting View. Tools. Comments. Open. Clicking a comment identifies the related comment or area on the drawing. Read each comment carefully. All requested corrections must be fixed before resubmitting this document. Please note, some comments may not apply to a specific drawing or detail, and may be a request for an additional form or pending approval from another agency. To create a list of these comments that you can print, choose File. Print. Summarize comments. Select Yes when prompted. Now that you know the corrections you need to make, it's time for Step 3. Once you've made the required corrections, save your new revisions in PDF format, no larger than 50 megabytes. For help using automatic sorting in Eclipse, go to the Help Using Eclipse section of the City website. Scroll down to ePlans and open the Submission Standards document. Step 4. Resubmit updated documents. Return to your Eclipse account to upload your new revisions. Take the following steps for each document. Select the checkbox for the document to be replaced. Click Upload New Version. Choose your newly revised document from your files and click Open. New revisions will be given a version number. If applicable, add comments here. If needed, you can add new documents by simply clicking the Upload button here. The department recommends applicants upload a formal response letter to address all plan review comments and markups. Once you're finished uploading, scroll down, add a final comment, and click Submit. Your permit application status will now show as in review, and city staff will soon recomplete any reviews that required revisions. Remember, changes to your permit application will appear in your Eclipse account. Once all outstanding re reviews are complete, the primary applicant will receive an automated email notification. This means, all technical reviews are complete, however additional items may be needed to issue your permit and generate an invoice. 
Thanks for watching. For more information check out our other Eclipse videos, FAQs, and resources at phila.gov forward slash li.